Hey Nexus War Commanders and fellow gamers. Welcome back to the channel. Today, we are diving deep into the world of T-Frames, one of the most powerful tools at your disposal in Nexus War. Get ready to optimize your army and dominate the battlefield. What is a T-Frame? You can unlock T-Frame dock when your city hall level reaches 18, and the T-Frame that belongs to your race will be sent to you directly. Exploring the T-Frame interface. Let's navigate the T-Frame dock. Here, you'll find four key icons representing different functionalities. Main page, this is your central hub for all things T-Frame related. Component manufacture, here's where you craft powerful components to enhance your T-Frame. Eradication, unleash your mecha army to liberate cities and earn valuable rewards. Component storage, manage your collection of components for your T-Frame. Unlocking interfaces and powering up. T-Frames have multiple interfaces waiting to be filled with components. Initially, you have one accessory interface and two fuel core interfaces. By researching frame reinforcement technology, you can unlock additional interfaces for even more customization. Components, the heart of your T-frame. Components are the core of your T-frame's strength. They can be categorized into two main types. Fuel core components, these enhance your troop stats and abilities. Accessory components, each accessory boasts a unique skill that can significantly impact your battle strategy. Boosting T-Frame Technology Dispersion fibers are your key to unlocking the full potential of your T-Frame's technology. Invest in research to unlock more interfaces, enhance component attributes, and ultimately unleash unique abilities tied to your race through the zero-point energy era tier. T-Frames for every race Initially, you'll have access to your race's dedicated T-Frame. However, fear not. Through methods like the Battle Pass, City Hall Level 25 Milestone, and Seasonal Gift Packs, you can acquire T-Frames belonging to other races, expanding your strategic options. Acquiring Powerful Components There are two primary ways to acquire components. Component Manufacture Craft components with your dispersion fibers, selecting desired attributes for a total of 2 to 3 per component. Component Smelting Utilize primary and volatile components, obtained through the T-Frame Store, Battle Pass, events, to create high-quality components with guaranteed epic, primary, or legendary, volatile, rarity. Eradication, reap the rewards of liberation. On the Eradication page, unleash the might of your mecha army to liberate cities. These conquests grant you valuable rewards like T-Codes, Talek, and Dispersion Fibers, further fueling your T-Frame development. Manage your component arsenal. Successfully crafted components are stored in the component storage. Here, you can view, sell, and even synthesize your modules into complete components. Additionally, enhance your accessory components by consuming duplicates or general modules of the same quality, boosting their effectiveness in battle. Conclusion By mastering the art of T-frames, you'll unlock a whole new level of power in Nexus War. Experiment with component combinations, unleash your T-frames abilities, and dominate your opponents. Don't forget to like and subscribe for more in-depth Nexus War Guides. See you on the battlefield, Commanders.